Hello, and the music is down. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I am the Curious Con Man, and today, well, we're going to be playing Thousand Week Reich. Yes, I've played this mod plenty of times before, and but we've known each other for so long. I mean, you know the rules, and, and so do I. We have to play this mod because you guys love it. And, well, I like it, too. And which fabulous country we're going to play as? Yeah, we're going to be playing as uh, some weird, crazy, you know, national Sigma male socialist uh, guy in the German... No, we're going to be playing as the only true 1950s Sigma male. This one, right? Yeah, this one, right? Yeah, this one, right? Yeah, this one, right? Yeah, this one. That's that's right. Nova Zabrisk with uh, everyone's favorite man, Nikolai Friedrich Drozdev. Yes, I know. I know so the Soviet stuff. Yeah. Hey, I, if I can pronounce two L's in Spanish, no, I, I can't pronounce two L's in Spanish. You guys made sure to very much point that out. Well, I felt it was only necessary. We uh, decided that we must play this mod, and who we're picking at two words that I never thought would go together: Khrushchev and democracy. I know I'm as surprised as you, but uh, okay, maybe I'm not as surprised. No, I think the corn is really getting to him. Good to see you're still chugging along down there, Gaul. <laughs> Gaul, I feel like it's, uh, it's time for you to really just, just give up at this point. I mean, Beria never gave up on his dreams of ruling the U.S. Beria? Beria, what happened to you? Oh, well, I'm sure he must have had a nice, peaceful death in his sleep. Oh, God, I'm shuddering and crossing my legs thinking about it. We're going straight from step one, secure the keys, to step eight, freedom! Yeah! Or maybe, or, uh, or maybe... Maybe not. I guess you don't exactly have too much time. Oh! Artillery attacking the- oh, That would be so sad to see him go, though. That. Now that. That's pretty good. Uh-oh. What? Uh-oh. Uh okay, now, America, how did you let this happen? Ladies and gentlemen, we've upgraded from breach loaded to bolt action. I know, I know. God damn it, we're in such a terrible position. Oh, well, I guess, uh, good for you, De Gaulle. You're kind of, uh... Semi-legitimate state now. Uh, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, I wasn't paying attention. Well, let's... Good thing I had some guys on the border. Sorry, Zhdanov, no no space for you. Zhdanov? Zhdanov's how I pronounce it, right? Hold on one sec. Zhdanov. Okay, Zhdanov. Okay, so I was saying it right. God damn it! Why are you guys everywhere? Now that that's out of the way, let's just uh, condemn Marxism. Yeah, that's a uh, it's the grind set. Too busy beating my wife and condemning Marxism to to care about anyone. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's the grind set. You know the Sigma grind set. You got artillery too, so you got to somehow throw artillery in there. I don't know. Listen to eighteen twelve overture when you wake up. That may work. You're trying to tell me that the Canadians straight up shot. The French people that lived in their country, the Qu Quebecois. Yeah, how un-Canadian of you guys. Come on. Actually, I'm going to be honest. That Quebec is like living in France, but worse. See, come on. The, the leader of France can't even stand to look at it. He's got his eyes closed. Ah, are you ready for your state-mandated corn supplement? Well, I am, and... Oh, what? Now that's simply silly. Ah, yes, there we are. Novosibirsk. Right below Iran and right above Vietnam. Nikita, Nikita Khrushchev. Yeah, Franco couldn't handle me saying Khrushchev. Uh, the worst part of Khrushchev, though, is now I gotta finally figure out what the heck good artillery look like. Oh, no. Couldn't have predicted that. Oh. Well, you know what they say. He had the same ending as all the, all the people he killed, so... That's great equalizer. What more can you say? Come on, come on, Syria. It's Israel. I mean, it's, it, it's not like. Okay, yeah, I know you're right. Now that, uh, well, a certain someone's uh, unexpected demise has caused insufferable turmoil in Eastern Europe, <laughs> the one man who could fix it all, well, he's starting the boat off early, isn't he? Uh, oh, Spear and Goebbels. Hmm. Wonder which one of them is going to come out on top. Nope. Apparently neither, because, uh, well, there's the Civil War. Sorry. <clears throat> that looks like Burgundy's gonna pop up again. How, how can you guys let this happen? There it goes. You go, Ukraine. Khrushchev's mission, his vision far exceeds that of his late Dreznov or any of his rivals. And I can tell you, it's pretty ambitious. So I'm gonna quickly, as quick as possible, rush down to here 
get this alliance with the um this saucer and this saucer which together we should be able to crush the ussr maybe possibly you know Ooh, yeah for a risky plan we are going to need the unions on our side thank god uh forging my welfare forms did not pass oh uh, any second now please say hey, yes they did oh what oh himmler oh. well that i haven't seen that before but transvol Oh, <laughs> don't mind me. Oh, why, how how lovely. You guys are just the sweetest. And now that we have uh, well, everybody in our full strength and mass, we can finally end the sad sob story, which is the USSR. How unfortunate. It's led by... God, I have a big bushy beard now. That, like, screams monarchist czar. Ugh, how awful. Whoa, ho, whoa, cubic, whoa, oh, wait, what? You're, you're literally divided in half now, can't- what? Well, that was unexpected. They even have a focus tree, and it's- It's- Freaking bigger than mine! <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for us- Oh, I didn't plan. Anyways, it is now time for us to officially, uh... That's calling our buds here. What? Yeah, I can't get in here, please. I would, uh... Severe, sincerely appreciate it. This tank right here, and I'm gonna right-click on perm! Yeah, let's, uh, let's get a move on. <laughs> All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there we go. We have conquered a lot of. We've conquered the Soviet Union, and so it's all uphill from here. Or it's easier, or no, it's. Right, we can only go up from here, all right? Sky's the limit. More like Siberia. Wonderful, stunning, and boom! Novosibirsk Khrushchev, you've done it, you bastard. And well, the uh, now we gotta annex. Uh, well, we gotta annex spaceman and anarchists. <laughs> Imagine being led by a building pfft, and not Khrushchev. No, oh, please just accept my darn welfare reforms. All I got. Don't mind if I ever so subtly just uh, reacquire territory. How thoughtful, Chile. I mean. There's so many countries. Algeria, Chile. Guys, 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 look at our GDP. We're now, we're now right above Albania. <laughs> our quality of life is slightly above Albania. So obviously that's uh, not saying. Oh, finally. Oh, I was waiting when I'd get core, so nothing was in my focus stream. With the Soviet rump state being taken back by our allies, we find ourselves as the predominant Russian power. No longer are we a mere warlord state. We now are the holders and claims of all of Russia. The Russian pe- Are you proud, Khrushchev? Here you are, and any second now, any second now, and se there we go. Hey, hey! A spectacular developments took place in the former Soviet Union, with Novosibirsk warlord state under leader Nikita Khrushchev and together with its allies, marched and overthrew the Perm government. Look at, look at those lovely factories now, and stuff to repair. But but look at look at I can make guns now. Now we have graduated to a just above Turkey. I know. 
blow Argentina, so I guess it's not all that bad. It's doing better than Mexico. Thank you, anarchist government, for giving me uh, 28 rifles. <laughs> you find that in the basement of some old guy's home because I'm pretty sure that's all that's here in the middle of uh, upper western Siberia. Ah, finally a drop of calm and a chaotic sea. Russians, People's Republic as well. More peoples than it is republic, in my opinion. Or actually, more more republic than peoples, in my opinion. Oh, we got a, a decent army now. And, uh, yeah, I'm producing some tank divisions. Look how, <laughs> look how beefy those guys are. Oh, well, there goes the fun. Yep, Germany is gone. And looks like de Gaulle got enough revenge for him to be satisfied. God, that is just ugly ultra visionary communism more like ultra shitsonary communism uh, did it Liechtenstein. they really added Liechtenstein. really ah uh, the reich is finally gone holy crap slovakia what the slovakia has made an enemy of the free world but through pure fascist slovakian might they <laughs> so... <laughs> how'd that happen oh and spain too what what are the liberals doing? Oh, no, no, not the Spanish children, please. And it breaks my heart, but the Tanatuvan state has to come under my control. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I had to. It's the only way I can progress my focus. I'm so sorry, guys. Oh, no, Adolfsburg. How awful. Oh, no. Ah. Meanwhile, I'm too busy doing the fun stuff. Oh, I thought it was to declare war. No, it's a war goal. All right. It gives me just just a tad more time to uh prepare my offensive lines don't mind me if i just uh finally reunite my country with each other and I, oh almost got the airplanes Oh, that, now that, that is just beautiful perfection. Reddit, this is a wholesome Khrushchev moment. Oh man, all these guys are gonna make so much corn in the POW camps. Ah, beautiful, melting away the divisions. Cause they've been in circles, so yeah. Casualties now. Oh, come on, I'm doing well. All right, well, there we go. The uh, pockets have been building. Now we can fully divert all our attention on, well, getting to Vladivostok, so that'll be quite lovely. Well, uh, let's see. <laughs> yeah, you guys are kind of a, what's the word, uh, yeah, a joke now. Uh, you fools, you have left your flank open, and, well, uh, you're not gonna have the front to protect anything if, you know, there's, the, all the homeland's gone. There you go, Vladivostok. Perfect. And any second now, we finally enter the capital, the nice warm port city. Actually, I'm not sure if this is a warm port. But you still get the- Oh, come on! One freaking militia division. Okay, what the hell? Where was I? Right, Vladivostok. Oh, and there we go. 10,000 M3 carbine. You know what? I'll happily take that American equipment. Good stuff to me. And there we go! Ho! Oh. Well, now, huge GDP level is number six. 
Finally, we're above Germany. Below Malaysia. Malaysia? What? I mean, I, I guess that makes sense. I just, I, I didn't know it was that high. Finally, right, where was I? Right, unifying Western Russia and having it all under the command of Comrade Khrushchev, People's Representative Khrushchev, because we're Social Democrats. Oh, finally! Oh, I'm so happy. Our welfare, as our welfare reforms have passed. Oh, how awesome! Now just the other stuff has to go through all well and dandy, and we'll be out of here in no time. I mean, out of here. I mean, economic depression. All right, let's see if our very wonderful, faithful allies. Oh, well, that. That was that. Bada bing, bada boom. Now we're in number four. Ha! Huh, right above Ch China. Ha! China sucks to be China. But, uh, well, that that was easy. Now all that's left is free Russian movement and the young Russian committee. What fascinating original name. Ah, oh, Khrushchev reunites Russia. Ah, <laughs> uh, what a lovely event. Russia rises again. But look, at, look at that lovely gr- oh. Uh, you guys know you I like the day night cycle, but you know what if you don't like it I'll turn it off and on the whole game. At, yeah, it's been on the whole game, but there we go. We're not done yet though Not just yet and Finally, huh? Oh Go to war with all these guys well And finally, okay. Yeah now let's fix the borders are coming We're coming to do some de-stalinization. Yeah you gotta let her like it or not, we're gonna rename Petroglad to Oh, Khrushchev Bill. That's a that's a good name, isn't it? Better like it. And there they go, we got 50,000, you know, crappy bolt-action rifles, but eh, they're guns nonetheless. We can use them in case you ever need to throw them at an invading enemy. Because, you know, we don't exactly have any natural defenses against people now, do we? Steps and planes. And another one bites the dust. There we go. Who could have thought it? Yeah, I did, because I invaded in. Would have done it if I didn't win. And look, I won! And you even got a port. Finally! Finally, some European contact. We're no longer gonna be a backwater swamp, guys. One more, and that's a uh, Ukraine, eh? Alright, there we go. Finally, look at that awful flag we're burning. That's that's obviously the regime we're going for. It's not 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 anyone else. Well, that's uh oh, I'll have one more quick one to just gobble up there. Oh, say thank you for the 65 planes. I, I appreciate it. Uh, look, buddy, I, I don't know what you're smoking, but uh, I don't exactly think that your regime is going to last any so much longer. Just Okay, can the borders just get clean for just a second? Thank you. Frankly, I'm going to be quite honest with you. One of these fine gentlemen does not match the other. I, can, I can't tell which one it is. And finally, the last one, so I can finally say that, uh, well, I can do these focuses. Because, well, yeah, okay. Yeah, uh, okay, well, that wasn't, that wasn't much of a challenge, no, it was I gotta play, like, Hoi 4, a multiplayer. Get a real challenge, show off my skills, and cry in the corner when I get encircled. It's usually what will happen. Uh, that's right, I... Finally have the sweet, sweet state of Georgia. That's right, people. Joseph Stalin was a conf- No, I'm, no, the joke is- The joke is shit when you say it out loud. Well, that was a fun Khrushchev experience, wasn't it? Well, let's guess. What do you think my GDP is? Wasn't expecting that, to be honest. I would have thought maybe fourth, but- <laughs> Number two? You know what? I'll take it. Alright, thank you again so much for watching, guys. Uh, I just wanted to show off a little fun little path this weekend and, uh, you know, just 
just have a little fun. Return to a Thousand Week Reich and see who won the German Civil War. Fun fact, no one did. Actually, I'm pretty sure I know who won the German Civil War. It was, it was Slovakia. I, how, how'd that even happen? A special warm thank you to Aaron Moon Unit, Deathkill, Moonwalking Roosevelt, Pronifin, Bismarck Lover, CSP67, Bubblegum Ice Cream, 9, and a special thank you to Steven. Thank you all to being wonderful Patreons to my community, and I wish you all a wonderful evening.